She stood on the porch, the afternoon sun casting long shadows across the neatly mowed lawn. Children's laughter drifted from a nearby park, a stark contrast to the quiet ache in her heart. In her hand, she held a glass of lemonade, the condensation a cold reminder of the tears she wouldn't let fall. It was Memorial Day, a day for barbecues and family gatherings, but for Sarah, it was a day etched in sorrow, a day forever bound to the memory of her husband, Sergeant Michael Johnson. Michael, a proud Marine, had given his life in the searing deserts of Afghanistan, a sacrifice she carried with her every single day. The pain of his absence was a constant companion, a dull throb that intensified on this day, a day meant to honor heroes like him. As she raised her glass in a silent toast, a single tear escaped, tracing a path down her cheek, a testament to a love that even death couldn't extinguish. Memorial Day, a day of solemn remembrance, a day to honor the fallen, a day to remember the cost of freedom. For Sarah, it was a day to remember Michael, to cherish the memories, to keep his spirit alive in the laughter of their children, in the stories she shared, in the quiet moments of reflection. It was a day to remember that his sacrifice, and the sacrifice of so many others, ensured that families like hers could enjoy the freedoms so many take for granted. Before we continue with this special video of Memorial Day, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button and don't forget to turn on post notifications. The roots of Memorial Day run deep in American history, tracing back to the aftermath of the Civil War, a conflict that tore the nation apart and left countless families shattered by loss. In the wake of this devastating war, a grieving nation seeking solace and a way to honor the fallen began the tradition of decorating the graves of soldiers with flowers, a poignant gesture of remembrance. The small town of Waterloo, New York, lays claim to being the birthplace of Memorial Day, officially proclaimed by General John Logan, Commander-in-Chief of the Grand Army of the Republic, in 1868. Initially known as Decoration Day, it was a day set aside to honor the Civil War dead by decorating their graves with flowers and flags, a tradition that resonated deeply with a nation still healing from the wounds of war. Over time, Decoration Day evolved into Memorial Day, a day to honor all Americans who died while serving in the armed forces, a testament to their courage and sacrifice. The last Monday in May was designated as the official day of observance, a day for parades, speeches, and moments of quiet reflection, a day to remember the true cost of freedom. The aroma of barbecue smoke fills the air, the sounds of children's laughter echo through parks and backyards, and American flags flutter proudly in the breeze. Memorial Day for many marks the unofficial start of summer, a time for family gatherings, picnics, and relaxation. But amidst the festivities, it's crucial to remember the true essence of this day, to look beyond the barbecues and beach trips and acknowledge the solemn significance it holds. Memorial Day is a day to reflect on the sacrifices made by those who fought and died for the freedoms we cherish. It's a day to remember the soldiers who never returned home, the families forever changed by their absence, the Gold Star mothers who carry the weight of their grief with quiet dignity. It's a day to pause and acknowledge the true cost of freedom, a cost paid in blood, sweat, and tears. The parades, the speeches, the laying of wreaths at memorials, these are not mere rituals. They are powerful reminders of the debt we owe to those who served. They are a testament to the indomitable spirit of those who answered the call of duty, who put their lives on the line to protect the ideals of freedom and democracy. Memorial Day is a day for gratitude, a day to honor their memory, not just with words, but with actions that reflect the depth of their sacrifice. The impact of military service extends far beyond the battlefield, leaving an indelible mark on veterans and their families long after the uniforms have been stored away. The memories of combat, the loss of comrades, the invisible wounds of war, these experiences shape their lives, influencing their perspectives, their relationships, their very being. For many veterans, Memorial Day is a poignant reminder of fallen comrades, their memory etched forever in their hearts. It's a day to share stories, to offer support to fellow veterans, to find solace in shared experiences. The bonds forged in the crucible of combat run deep, providing a sense of camaraderie and understanding that transcends the civilian world. Memorial Day is also a time for families of fallen soldiers to come together, to find strength in shared grief, to honor the memory of their loved ones. The pain of their loss never truly fades, but the support of others who understand their pain can provide a measure of comfort. 
It's a day to remember the sacrifices made not just by those in uniform but by their families as well. The families who stood by them, supported them, and continue to honor their memory.